Hi guys, if you are unable to install games or apps from Microsoft Store in Windows 11, here is the fix. The very first fix is just search Microsoft Store in the search box. Now right click on Microsoft Store and click on App Settings. Now this setting panel window will open up and in the right side scroll down and find Reset option under Microsoft Store. Click on Reset and click on Reset and this will reset your Microsoft Store and after that try again and your problem will be fixed. If this does not get fixed, there is one more method which you can try and that is reinstalling Microsoft Store. So just search PowerShell, right click on Windows PowerShell and click on Run as Administrator. Click on Yes on the command prompt. Now what you have to do, you have to run this command first. First of all, we will remove this Windows Store package, hit enter. Now what you have to do, you have to run this command, copy, paste it, hit enter and now open Microsoft Store again and try uh, installing it again and your problem will be fixed. If this also does not fix your issue, there is one more thing which you can do and that is click on your profile icon, sign out and then click on it again and sign in again okay if this also does not fix your issue click on library and click on get updates to update all apps and games and after that try again if this also does not fix this there is one more fix just search services in the search box now click on services to open now locate background intelligent transfer services double click on it click on start to start it okay and after that click on okay similarly locate microsoft store install service double click on it make sure it is running if it is not if it is already running click on stop and then click on start to basically restart it if it is not running click on start click on apply click on okay now locate windows update now once you look at it, Windows Update, double click on it. Make sure it is running. If it is not running, click on Start. If it is already running, click on Stop once and then click on Start. Click on Apply, click on OK and now try again and your problem will be fixed. I have given all these codes of the PowerShell in the description of this video. You can directly find them. That's it guys. Please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the game.